let me do it the other way and the first one to be 1200 then 3000 then we can have from this point we can have uh, 1200 sorry we can have yeah I think we can have that let's put it let's put 1200 and 1200 and click on enter then you can copy this or just drag a copy so that is the shape that we are creating so I'll go to stairs design design tools I'll activate my stair tool make sure all these are selected which is left railing and the right railing and then I'll start from this point and I'll select the first option should be la um, flight so we have this flight from here to here and then the next one is also a flight going up to this point click and then we will turn and have another flight up to this point so double click and then my stair case will be placed so if you look at it closely we have here this is the first that is our first flight and then we have a landing here we have another flight up to that point we have another landing and from there we have a flight uh, which is going sorry the flight is going up uh, down to the other floor above the ground floor so if you look at it it's it's a uh, three flights and two landings so you will you can get a project where you are required to have such a uh, a guy as a type of a staircase and you will need to be able to create that if you're using a keycard so as 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 done previously i will select it and try to fit it to that i think we can go to the settings dialog and then from there under the number of risers we can change that to 18 and click ok and it's going to adjust itself automatically if it does not adjust automatically you can try to do it manually like that it's going to be ok so once again we go to our 3d view and try to see what we have created in a three dimensional view so when it loads this is this is now uh, the stair that we've created you can see as I was explaining we have this flight which goes up once 
there is a landing at this point and then you go up once again another flight then there is a landing and then you are going up once again so that's how to do that I hope you are able to do that after following this tutorial so I think the next the next one is a circular one I don't know whether to call it a circular or a semicircular, but it appears as a semicircle on the plan. And it's pretty, very simple. The only thing I'm required to do is to create a semicircle. I want to use a diameter of let's say 3 meters sorry I will choose single line then I will choose uh, from this point I will choose click on there type 3 meters and then use my circle or locate the center and draw from there up to that point so we have our semicircle ready then we go to the stair tool then we start in drawing from this point then we will use here and uh, the type of uh, segments I want to use arc by three points so click on arc by three points then I will take this first point 45 degrees angle and then I will click and the next point is the end point and I will click again and I then after clicking you see now you can be able to control how, how long uh, this one goes but want it to fit to that point so we just double click and we'll have it placed on the floor plan escape Sorry. so that's it that's our circular uh, staircase so if you go to the 3d view you can also be able to appreciate how it looks in a uh, real life so as we wait for the 3d to show i'm uh, just reminding you that you can support my work by subscribing to my youtube channel and if you choose to subscribe please make sure to click on the bell icon to turn on your notifications and that in that way when I post a new video about Akikad will be one of the first people that will be send a notification to be one of the first people to view the video and to learn the concepts and the tips and tricks that I teach on this YouTube channel So if you can see, this is the type of, uh, this is what we've created, you can try to orbit around and have a look, so it's, it's that easy guys, I hope you've, uh, you have learned something, and this brings us to the end of our two part tutorial staircase or rather how to use the stair tool to create the different types of uh, stairs in Archicad. Thank you for watching this video. If you like it, please give it a thumbs up. Uh, leave a comment in the comment box below. Subscribe to this YouTube channel and don't forget to 
keep learning so thank you guys i'll see you in the next video